Working with pictures in Word. Now Word 2007 and Word 2010 have their own set of commands for working with pictures. And what I'm going to do is I've got some text in front of me. I'm going to insert a picture. So up to our Insert tab. Click on Picture. And we're going to take a picture from our Pictures Library from the Computer Images folder. Select the picture you want, insert. OK, so our picture has gone into our text. And as you notice, our Picture Tools menu has appeared on our ribbon. Now that picture is way too big for what I want. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to reduce it in size. So across to the size group, and just by reducing the width, it will automatically keep the ratio and the height will reduce as well. So by clicking on the width, my picture is reducing in size to a more manageable size. OK, so we can reduce it in size. We can crop it. So that means we can take just part of the picture. Now if we were working with a picture of a person, we could just crop it so we have the head. So up here we've got the crop it. And if I click on there, bring in the corners to crop it if I wanted to. Like so. But I'm quite happy with this. So I'm going to go to the undo button. Click on the undo button. And we have our picture that we resized. Picture styles. We can change the way that our picture looks with the borders around it. By moving along on our styles we can see a preview of how it would look. There with a shaded background. A reflection so all sorts of picture styles that we can use. I'm just going to select the soft edged rectangle like so. And then we can position it. So we can position it with text wrapping. Again we get a preview. I haven't clicked on anything yet. I've just put my cursor over the top so we can preview how we want it. Text on both sides and text in a corner. And then we can text wrap. We can do all sorts of things with the text around this. We can even have our text behind the picture. So if I move down to behind the text, our text runs through at the back of our picture. So there's lots and lots of different things that we can do with pictures. And when you get a chance, have a go, have a play with it. Thanks very much.